community in Allen is grieving for the eight lives lost in a mall massacre on Saturday. Seven others were hurt. Three are in critical condition tonight. ABC's Melissa Adon is in Allen, where tonight she's learning more about the shooter. Governor Greg Abbott attending a vigil in Allen, Texas on Sunday as the community gathered to mourn the eight lives lost when a gunman opened fire at an outlet mall. The victims range in age from 5 to 61. Among those victims, 20-year-old Christian LaCour. His sister tells ABC he worked at the mall. Investigators are reviewing this graphic video that shows the gunman stepping out of a car and opening fire on people on the sidewalk at the Allen Premium Outlets north of Dallas Saturday afternoon. We got shots fired at the Allen Mall. A police officer was in the area on a different call when he heard the gunshots. Minutes later, saying he'd taken down the shooter. Quatina Ely says she sheltered in a fitting room, the gunman firing at her parents who survived. They began to run and they both fell to the ground. Maybe he thought that he had shot them, so he turned the gun and began shooting in the other direction where there were a lot of people. Who Former Army officer Stephen Spainauer says his son works at the mall. He says he was at the scene within minutes and tells ABC's Matt Gutman he called 911. I was on the operator. I was counting bodies and I told her I've got seven bodies. I need seven ambulances and she's like, what? I don't know if we have that many. And what was the state of this little boy? You said he was about four years old. Yeah, he's four or five and he was underneath some of the adults. They fell on top of him. He managed to get out and he was covered in blood, so I got him to a safe spot so I could get him out first. The suspected shooter has been identified as 33-year-old Mauricio Garcia. Investigators have searched his home in Dallas. We believe at this point that the shooter acted alone. Melissa Don, ABC News, Allen, Texas.